G'day, g'day everyone. So at the moment, there's just so much fuel for fires and we have got bad fires burning all across Australia, particularly on the east coast. And just outside the small town here, I'll show you some of the um, some of the effects of the years of drought we've had and how much is just waiting to go up. Have a look at this. Everywhere you turn out here is just dead and crispy. There's um, dead grass, dead plants, dead leaves. All this undergrowth everywhere is just so combustible, it's unbelievably bad how dry it is. So hot, and we've been getting some real windy days too. It's not too bad at the moment, but you get a bit of wind behind them fires and it just spread through this like nothing else. This is bad, all right. So some people are blaming politicians and um, saying we should have backburned better and that may be the case, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure on that, I don't follow the politics of it. And um, some people say climate change, all the difference in weather we've had, that may be the case too but I'm no expert. All I know is we're in a dangerous position at the moment with all this dryness around us and um, dead vegetation and lack of water. So more than us, just the wildlife and the animals too are really suffering. I love a sunburnt country, a land of sweeping plains. But I've got to tell you mate, I like it better when it rains. The countryside is dying and there's just no end in sight. And just to rub salt in the wounds, the bush has caught a light. The landscape is on fire from Brisbane to the Gong and everybody's asking where the hell did we go wrong? But we can get through this one if we help each other out. Take care of your neighbour, that's what Aussies are about. The rain is going to fall again, the good times will return. But living in Australia means at times it's going to burn. So if you need a helping hand, just give a mate a call. We're all here to help you and catch you when you fall. The RFS, the SES, the fireys and police all put their lives upon the line to help keep the peace. So hats off to these heroes and thanks for all you do. And I hope when this is over, we can make it up to you. Poem written by Troy Gerdes. <laughs>